YouTube, what's good, man? We back with another vi video, man. Welcome back to y'all's ZNT channel for the get into a reaction video. Predator get exposed at his job, man. Gotta start exposing these folks, man. These weird folks. I right, chill. Let's see what's going on. Like to order today? Absolutely nothing. Arby's is disgusting. Kind of like my friend Alvin. He what y'all think about Arby's, man? He said his friend. But anyway, what y'all think about Arby's? I, I, I kind of like Arby's, man. I'm cool. You know what I'm saying? Just a little bit. I don't eat that too often. Probably eat that once a year, maybe, of that. But, you it's know. Arby's. And his favorite thing to get here is the number <laughs> with no bun. What? You see, Alvin not only works for the most disgusting restaurant. Alvin, bro. Did you see him? Instantly, he got his fingernails painted. I never see, seen an old man with his fingernails painted. That's different, though. Never he seen He works that for the most disgusting restaurant ever, but he's trying to do the most disgusting thing ever as well. According to Weatherford PD detectives, he was trying to diddle a young boy at his place of what? work. Meet Alvin Ross. What? No relation to Simon and Theo. A 43-year-old man. He works at Arby's, where he claims to be the manager. Ain't he a manager? That boy kind of high up in Arby's. And he out here trying to... I mean, I guess it's no... He was also previously arrested on some possession of that Heisenberg... There's no way he a manager out here trying to get the kids, bro. No matter who, you got to watch out at all times. Because my boy look totally different. Different hairdo at least. Sugar, where he's still on parole for. On this explosive episode of EDP Watch, not only did our taste buds run away from the disgusting Arby's food, but Alvin decided. Ain't no to way that. Whoa, 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 we ain't gonna just slide by there like that was. That wasn't no way that was Arby's. That looked disgusting. Buds run away from. It's like I can't play the video with clicking on the video no more. Disgusting Arby's food. But Alvin decided to run away as well. <laughs> oh, we look from crazy. The wrong 12. He just left out the truck. He took off running? We are picking up our dear friend, Alvin. He is trying to meet a 15 year old boy. He's actually very successful, man. He is actually the manager of an Arby's. For his lunch break, he wants a 15 year old boy in the back of a dumpster. I guess Arby's doesn't have the meat, so he has to import it in. That meat is rotten, it's expired. It's actually illegal to eat it. There's gonna be a lot of Arby's meat jokes. You know, the jokes write themselves. Man, we're gonna go catch this man right here. He's trying to meet up with a 15 year old boy today. He's the manager at an Arby's. I guess they really do have the meat. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's just true. Yeah, it's not funny though. No, we're gonna catch him. Yeah, there's a lot of penis pictures in here. We didn't believe him that he had the meat, but like he showed us he did. Yeah, he's yeah. Absolutely punished. Yes, ma'am. Alvin, man, say you need to be punished. It's not my call. Girl, wild. Thank you, man. I appreciate you, man. Shout out to FedEx, man. He looked out on the printing. Didn't charge me at all, man. Now, due to YouTube's strict policies, we can't say the age of the decoy, but Alvin's favorite order from Arby's is the number th Hey, Alvin. No. It's Mikey from Grinder. What's up, bud? Swap picks? <laughs> sure. There's no way he out here sending pics like that to little kids, bro. It's like, it's like, I don't even know, how would, how are you interested? Like, it makes no sense. You gotta be sick in the head. Or did you mean the naughty ones? Lol. Nah, uh, just selfies, lol. How old are you? Old enough. Alvin said this? Ain't no way he said this. <laughs> <laughs> How old? How old do you think? I don't know, uh, 35? Thanks. Close. I look younger than I am. I'm 42. 
Well, you're Ain't probably no gonna way, block. Bro. No worries. Don't be scared. I'll still talk to you no matter what you say. <sighs> okay. I, I'm. It's okay. You're being respectful, so how are you gonna show me this ain't also set up to get me in trouble? What do you mean, set up? Well, cops and people like to set up others to get in trouble over stupid Bruh, lol. I'm not about that. <laughs> okay. Are you a cop? Um, no. I'm far from it. I'm far from it, too. Ain't no way this man I here really... This is this real life, like... Is really what he's saying? He's the real message that he had together. There's no way. Got a creep. I don't like cops, really. Me either. Unless they wanted to get naked. Lol. What? Top? He said this dude right here said that. Or bottom bunk. Or versatile. What are we talking about? The difference between giving <laughs> and receiving. <laughs> I'm not sure what that stuff means. I'm new to all this stuff, lol. I like both. Both don't like each other. Top bunk is giving like getting or smashing. Bottom bunk is the one who gives and gets smashed. He's saying all this in the message, like bro. He just met a 13-year-old. Instantly said he don't care if he's 13. He start saying all of this, bro. It's no... Way, bro. Your peacock can get my peacock curvy and go from there. <laughs> You want to do all that to me? For real, for real? I want to make sure you enjoy what is done to you. Now, after passing Alvin's police detector, he then began to share things with us that no young boy should ever see. Let's just say Alvin doesn't live up to the motto of Arby's because he indeed does not have the meats. Good morning. Wait, face. Good morning, it's great. Oh, dang. Is that really you? Yes, sir. It is. I guess Arby's doesn't have the meats. I have Wednesdays off and Sundays. Oh, cool. Where do you work? I'm an Arby's manager. Oh, cool. What time do you work tomorrow? Maybe I can come by and get some free food. You can come up there and go in the dumpster area and tell me when you're there. And I could come out and make you Kirby my peacock and I can Kirby yours. No way. He's going to the... He's... Bruh. This foul, bro. This too foul. It's too foul. And if we're not busy, we can go to the bathroom and you tell me which one to meet you in. And do the same thing in there. Mom's what? See us? No, it has walls and the door closes. We can play Smash Bros and no one would know. Lol. <laughs> so he gay. Don't want to creep on a little boy, but he... Man, bro, this makes no sense. There's no way this grown man out here texting all this to a little kid. It's some real creature in this now, world. Now, it was clear to me, whether for PD, Theodore, and Simon, what Alvin's true intentions were. So we decided to go on and begin our investigation at the Arby's that he wanted to meet us at. It was obvious that he wanted to strike a chord, but it was most definitely a minor. <laughs> okay, so this is the plan. So when we get there, I'm gonna go through the drive-through. After I order the food, I'm gonna put his dick pic in the bag and when you guys see me headed in that's when you guys head in when i start confronting him that's when you guys do y'all thing and just get in position and stuff we're uh here at the arby's get your guys car parked over there we're pulling in back here for two zero arby's would you like to try a burger barbecue brisket today um no actually i would love to try the number 13. the number 13. oh that's my favorite number would you like to upsize that to a large today no but uh can i get some predator to meet with that do i have can i get some predator to meet with that if you guys have any at this location <laughs> bro, real troll, bro. <laughs> Give me one second. Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it, ma'am. It's fine. All righty. 11.46. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Good, good. We're about to go over there. There's a basketball game we're about to go film. Down the street. Oh, cool. A YouTuber meetup. Yeah, there's a basketball game down the street. Thank you. They ain't have no idea. He's gonna pick up the manager. Calm. I did. He like peeped over. Thank you. You as well. Drop us off right here at the sidewalk. We're about to head in. He was definitely peeping. 
I saw him. Oh, I'm not gonna lie, I am nervous. You got the number 13? Oh yeah. yeah. Pretend you guys just aren't with me, just wait a sec. Hey, excuse me? You said it number 13. Yeah, but I'm not gonna lie, there's something wrong with this order. Is there a manager here? I am the manager. Why am I being filmed right now though? Is um is there an Alvin here? An Alvin? Yeah. Yes. Are you are you Alvin? Yes, sir. Hey, did you make my curly fries? Can you look at this real quick? Yeah, I mean like they're cool, but like there's just like this like weird meat in here. This is weird meat. If you could come have a conversation with us over here. Okay. What's up with this meat in here? He okay. laughed. You don't he seen it and laughed, bro. Bro, real creep. What? That was his reaction? There's no way he just seen that. It's like weird meat in here. <laughs> he laughed weird instantly. If you could come have a conversation with us over here. Okay. What's up with this meat in here? I don't know. You don't know? Yeah, man. I mean, I wanted the number 13, but like, I don't think you should be sending this to 13 year olds. I don't know what you're talking about. You don't know what I'm talking about? No. Okay. This is you right here, right? Yeah, but I mean, you can get that off the internet anywhere. Oh, you can? Well, um, we also have an hour long phone conversation with you. And you also uh, say you want to meet us out by the uh, by the trash can area? No. Oh, you didn't say that? No. You said, because I don't get out really of want to have you moan in pleasure. Out. Your friend here, he sent images of his penis to okay. what he thought was a 15 year old boy. I'm gonna need y'all to exit my store, please. Oh, okay. Exit the store, or I'm calling no, the cops. Should... Oh, you should call the cops. Exit the store. Can I get a refund for my number 13? Alan, can you help me with this, please? He's talk, he talking about calling, he talking about calling the cops. The cops are already there, bro. He said the cops are here. I'm gonna exit my store, please. Oh, okay. Exit the store, or I'm calling no, the cops. Should... Oh, you should call the cops. Can I get a refund for my number 13? Alan, can you help me with this, please? Okay, yeah, sure. So, uh, one of our Alvin, he sent explicit pictures to what he thought was a 15-year-old boy. So anything involving camera, we don't, we don't allow for Okay, let's see if we can find Alvin. Are you the manager? We don't No, this is going crazy. Are you the manager? I'm saying for your record, we don't uh, consent to filming. So are you the manager? Not gonna be on, are you the manager? Our private property. Okay, but do you consent to, you know, your employees sending explicit pictures to 15 year old boys? I don't consent to anything. So okay. you don't care about people. Oh, you, it's public business, right? So you see that trash can right over there? He actually wanted to meet the 15 year old boy right over there. You want me to show so you that chat are, room? Are you an officer? Security officer, sir. Security officer four. Security company. You seem more worried about us than your predator so, back there working with curly fries. Hey, uh, is Alvin still in there? Oh. It looks like Arby's wants to protect the meat. Why do you guys want to protect Alvin's <laughs> meat? It's kind of sus. So I believe police is on the way. Uh, Thank you. That's exactly what we want. While we're out here, I might as well read you the chat log. I, I don't consent to being on camera. He said, fuck. I'm about to explode from the weight. No, this is just I for you. I, I don't. I, I don't consent to being on. Camera. Would you like to hear what your? No, I need to leave whatsoever. my premises right now. Well, right. we gotta wait for the police because we have to file a report about well, your you employee. Can do that at the station. Off the property. Off the property. So you don't care that your employee? Off the property. Officers and at his own residence, not at my. They don't even care. Well, he just wanted to take a year old boy to your place of residence, oh, right over there. He actually wanted to have right there at that trash can. Okay, we can stand right over here. So I consent to people trying to protect predators. Don't consent to that at all. Not on y'all property no more. But while I'm over here, I'm gonna read out what he said. I wish you could get away now for an hour. I can do a lot of things in an hour. You should actually record <laughs> Alvin. I, I think that's more important to record. He said, you could come up here. He's talking about Arby's. And go in the dumpster area and I could come out and make you my or make me yours and maybe we could meet in the bathroom and do the same do you guys have like a meet meet up area in the bathroom at arby's i never go i don't know anyone actually that goes the decoy said won't someone see us he said no it has walls and doors that close this it's doesn't no. have walls <laughs> this is real life man these folks tripping by brook and they getting recorded the whole time they land, bro. Work. They ain't, they ain't gonna quit. Hey, man, so you got you got something you need to go take care of out there. You trip. They like get off my property. Doors that close. Hey, we're off their property. We left when they asked. How you doing, officer? Good. We have a man in there. He was trying to meet what he thought was a old boy right out here next to this trash can. He also sent very explicit pictures. When we confronted him, they automatically kicked us out. His name is Alvin Vogler, but he sent pictures of his. He said, "I am so freaking." 
from thinking about today so much. When did when all this occur? This was about two, three weeks. As you can see over here, he said, I'm 42. <laughs> they got everything. We told him that, okay, I'm 15. This is the reason why we're here. We didn't just show up here to show up to his work and disturb. The reason why we came here was because he actually wanted to meet us here. He said, you could come up there and go in the dumpster area and I could come out and make you <laughs> Oh, it's so all what's going to happen. Does he get? The, does he go to jail off of this? Like, I mean, he should. He definitely should. But like, let's see what happened, man. Oh, sorry about that. That was just. Okay. RB slogan is we have the meat, but <laughs> he doesn't have the meat. <laughs> okay. That regional manager was a certified meat protector. Arby's corporate. You guys should be happy, man. They'll go down with their own, but maybe we should fix that policy. <laughs> Left out the he took off running. He took off running. Go get, it. go get it. Jet man took off running, man. You know he's wrong. He's trying to get out of there. See, I'm not the bad guy, y'all. I'm just trying to help. <laughs> that boy really thought he was gonna get away. Well, he's, he's, a runner. Runner. he's a track star. He went away, but he went too far. I don't think you're gonna work at Arby's no more. You do not have the meat. Alvin, why are you false advertising, man? You indeed do not have the meat. Oh, he's gone. So? Arby's? <laughs> hey, man, whatever you do, don't go to Arby's. I'm not. Hey. My man. Thank you guys so much. Yeah, absolutely, man. Officer, I'm not going to show you the picture, but even though he worked at Arby's, he indeed did not have the meat. Ah, okay. Don't worry, guys. We got <laughs> yeah, Okay. To skeet a predator. Okay. Just wondering. Like, skeet, skeet? Yeah. <laughs> I'm teacher, Well, congratulations. Since we're heroes, can we get some Arby's? Yeah, oh, I think he's just trying to trespass us, man. We're heroes. Bad casual advice. Well, I mean, it's not fast and casual when he's having sex with people at the trash can. You know what? Here, let me call my lawyer, Jay Yoma. I don't know what they had told you, but right when they told us to leave, we left. Okay, and then we fine. I mean, if they want to trespass us, they can. Yeah, okay. But I feel like we deserve an honorary meal. Okay, alrighty. So, that's, that's just your feeling? What you think about them is kind of irrelevant in regards to criminal trespass? Okay. Okay? I'm not going to lie. If you own this Arby's, would right. you have gave us a meal? I've never owned an Arby's before. So I don't really know. I think you would have gave us a meal. <laughs> would you guys like to buy the heroes a meal in there? We can't go inside. I don't even know what the heck he's trying to do. Okay, so that's where the detectives are. They're over there with my sergeant. If you if you all y'all want to walk down there and have a conversation with them. Okay, here. No, nah, this is just too crazy. Like no one eats at Arby's. No, that's okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How y'all doing? Can we go inside somewhere? It is hot. You want to meet us at Police Department? Yeah. All right, let's do that. Is you it cool? Where it's at? Uh, no. Is it cool if I get a ride? I'm used to being in the back of a patrol car. You grab with us if you Okay, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna just ride with them. My natural habitat. <laughs> Alvin, so he messaged us on the grinder app first. The decoy let him know right away that he was 15 years old. It got pretty sexual after that. Did y'all have a decoy that met with him? No. Since he had already said to meet at the um, his job, it's like he's already soliciting, and he's soliciting to himself. Yeah. So that's why we went there. You said you have everything on Google Drive where you can yes, sir. Over to us? We're gonna go Man, he fragged oh, yeah. real quick in the building. And if you guys want to take the chat log with y'all in there, yeah, absolutely. If it helps with the investigation that there is audio, yes, sir. This is in Grinder. Actually, funny enough, this isn't even a boy. It's uh, one of our female decoys. We just put a boy filter on it. Okay. The decoy asks, "How old are you?" He says, "Here, I'm 42." The decoy says, "How he's 15." <laughs> oh, my bad. I'm, I'm I'm sorry. I'm all over the place. No, that's okay. He also acknowledged how this could be, uh, you know, a sting operation. He said, so how you show me, though, this is not all just a setup to get me in trouble? The decoy asked, are you a cop? He said, mm, no, far from it. And then the decoy said, I don't really like cops. <laughs> <laughs> bro, this said, is, bro, this is real, real, real life. This man really just got set up. This man is stupid. As soon as he said 13, bro, even on Instagram, bro, I follow anybody before they say it. They say, I turned 17 this month. Unfollow, bro. I have no reason following no kids, bro. There's no point, no reason. I hope so. Me neither. Unless they wanted to get naked. So I don't think he'll like y'all because <laughs> I don't think y'all going to want to get naked. You want to take this with us? You, that's, that's literally yours. Man, they are about to tear him up. There's no way he survives that interrogation. Oh, good. Did everything, uh... Everything worked out. He confessed? Yeah, 
Yeah, enough. Okay. Thank you. That's my card. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm gonna get all. You're gonna email me that stuff. Yes, sir. Can I keep this? Yeah, that's you. This on a separate note. Yes, sir. Your criminal trespass warnings for Arby's. (sighs) So, uh, (laughs) I I guess Arby's got beef with us. (laughs) (laughs) That's fair to me. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Thank you, guys, so much. Thank you. Alvin's in booking right now. I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm so tired of all these rents due coming and stuff like that. I heard through the grapevine that there was a job opening at this one local restaurant. So I'm gonna just call real quick. Must been on get somebody else or something. It might be like the bait. Uh, I heard you guys had a job uh, opening. Uh, <laughs> he, he a troll, bro. Don't call the cops for harassment. I have your phone number. Quit calling here. Alvin was charged with (laughs) online solicit minor conduct and possession charges as well. And I'm glad to report that his parole is now on hold. We want to give a huge shout out to Weatherford PD for their diligence on this case. Couldn't have done it without them. And also a huge shout out to PCI for finding us Alvin. His link. Man, he folk crazy, boy. He for crazy, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. We're going to keep them coming in. We got a couple videos y'all requested, so we're going to get those out the way. Make sure y'all comment down any videos, more videos y'all want us to do. And uh, at the end of the day, stay y'all.